The NFL is again feeding people across the country with its taste of oh, the NFL and party you, for thank a purpose you, at the Super Bowl. Proceeds from the events go to food banks in each of the 32 NFL team cities, including the Free Store Food Bank in Cincinnati. Chef Michelle Brown from Jags was chosen this year, along with former Bengal David Fulcher to represent Cincinnati at the event. Michelle, welcome. Kurt thank Reimer you. from the Free Store, welcome. Thank you. Good to see you both. It's great to be with Michelle, you. let me start with you. Your first time going to Taste of the NFL? First time. How excited are you? I am. It's been on my butt bucket list for about 20 years and uh, to be able to represent our city and the Cincinnati Bengals mm -hmm. is just amazing so so excited. So tell me a little bit about what you had to do to prepare for this you I mean you had to do some fundraising <laughs> and some work. We did we did um, we fa uh, we did a lot of fundraising through the restaurant through um, our um, customers and through um, a lot of the community and um, we actually raised twenty-four thousand dollars. Wow! And, yeah, that's so great. We were, yeah, and Kurt, some other restaurants were involved in that too, right? Actually, actually, we had uh, all the restaurants that came as part of our Taste the NFL came in, but we had twelve restaurants that really participated in the Kick Hunter Challenge, which was really the the challenge to get everybody there. And right. and Michelle and Jags really just knocked it out of the park. I mean, they they came in with a, a signature dessert that you know people could buy, and you, you have to get two because you know, yeah, well, you have to. Take Why one not? Home, it's right? for a good cause. That's right. Michelle, what are you making for us? Of course, Jag's known for steaks and well, seafood. Well, um, yes, we are going to do our wild mushroom risotto with our black truffle filet. Ah. Um, it's the dish we're going to be doing at the Super Bowl. Okay. Um, we're cooking for 3,000 people. Wow. So we will caravan on Thursday down to Atlanta. Um, and a lot of our food will be shipped, but I'm going to teach you how to make ris risotto real quickly. Okay, Show good. you the dish. I so love I, risotto. Never made it before. Okay, so I have chicken stock, and I'm going to add some par-cooked risotto um, into it and kind of let it simmer in there. Hold on one second, a little bit more. And then we're going to use wild mushrooms. Okay. So it's shiitake, portobello, and some oyster mushrooms. Mm. And we're going to let that simmer. That's going to take a minute. And as we let that simmer up a little bit. Now tell me about the party with the purpose. What's that going to be? So the party with the purpose is 32 of um, the, the, um, um, the NFL team's right. chefs. So 32 chefs come to Atlanta. Um, they each have a booth, um, and they each represent their city oh, good. and their football team. And, and that's where David will be with you, right? And David will be right next that's to great. me in my booth. Yes. So, and um, people will roam around, kind of like our taste in NFL here in Cincinnati, and sample all the food. And we'll be raising money to free, feed the uh, hungry throughout the United States. And, and, and I, Kurt, I mean, I know a lot of people get on the NFL for certain things, but this is really a wonderful thing that they do to help people that you help. It really is. And when you think about the, the Bengals organization, we've been doing this for 16 years. Mm -hmm. um, and they've just been really, you know, really champions of our hunger initiative and in trying to fight hunger. And being able to have uh, you know, one of the top 50 Bengals, you know, David Fulcher there with us right. as well. I think he's like number six on the all-time <laughs> list. That's great. Uh, is amazing. But you know, having these wonderful chefs come in here and join us in the challenge to fight hunger is really amazing and really makes a difference in our community. And of course the Super Bowl is on Sunday night on Local 12, 6.30. I'll let you keep cooking. I might put that on my Facebook, but we got to go over to Tara to talk about the cold that you're going to miss. 